Hello everybody, Nature's here is here, hers 3 by 2 and today we're in the snow looking for some mountain hares. And what we're, why are they special? Because they're white. Yeah, we're looking for white hares in the snow in the Peak District. Bethany's with us, hers 3 by 2 We're just missing Thea and Mummy, but this is what the conditions are in at the moment. Just on our way to try and get to them. We know where we're going, Daddy's done the route before. Bethany, anything you want to add to the people? It's cold. Very good. So stay warm. So we've turned around because of this snow, with loads of it, uh, because we couldn't see very clearly where we were going and it's rather cold too. But, wow! This, I just walked in and it's absolutely massive. Look there, Roman spotted a big long icicle here. Originally we were going to show you a bunch of icicles over there, but then I just looked, saw that one and it was Show you these as well because these are quite cool. So, lots of them here with this lovely bit of kind of red lichen just coming through the snow there. Soon. And the icicles yeah, there. Fight. Then, when we get close to the car, yeah, we're going to have a snowball fight. She says she's got a numb bum. Yeah, I can't my feet That's because she decided to do a big foot. Daddy did a big footprint step as well. I haven't. Roman's not. But we decided to turn around because the conditions are a bit hard to read. We'll come back another day when it's, uh, it's getting towards the end of winter to see if we can get these mountain hares well, in their white we can find snow. Nice Roman's having a snowball fight here and a snow bath for the boy. Snow bath him. Woo. Bath him. <laughs> there he is. We are near to the car, so it should be cleaned and warmed up quickly. There he is. <laughs> yes, direct hit on the booping tin. Boys raiding. Oh, he's done well. Oh, another direct hit on the Boopington, blowing a leg off. <laughs> Shield! Quinter sword! <laughs> Boopington's down, snow bath! <laughs> Representing a snow angel. Boopington's missed him. <laughs> Here's the Boopington throw. Got him. Boopington's like a giraffe. <laughs> oh, on the bumps. <laughs> Don't, remember, yeah. Don't get soaking wet. three by two and today we're back at the hares in some icy snow this time. And very different conditions the last time we can actually see around as we're just on the on the path heading up to where we hopefully we'll see some hares in their white coats. A beautiful clear day today. We're making a headway because we don't want the weather to come in quick fire. Bethany's better kitted out in her warm bottoms and wellingtons this time. And Roman has found some rather cool looking icicles. Roman, just back up a little bit so I can squeeze in and show. That's it. Yeah. So we've got yeah, some amazing looking icicles down here. There we go, look at those beauties. On the way back. Well, I tell you what, let's have an icicle fight now. 
Right, quick high school fight, nature series high school fight. I'm glad you said these songs. <laughs> <laughs> and Boobington's is gone. I'm on! I've been disarmed. Careful, Roman, there's water here, there's water there. No, there's water here. Go on, just keep moving now, please. I would. And there we've got water coming through. Under the ice. Under the ice. Be careful, Roman, be careful. Go on, up you go, please. I'm going here. And they're off. Told you it's a good walk. It's worth it. Right, stop, Roman. Roman, just stand perfectly still, Roman. Listen. What do you hear? The wind. Silence is what I hear. What do you hear? Nothing. Silence. Nature's heroes, we've made it to the top, now we've just got to find the hairs. But look at this for a view today. We've just got to head past that sign, that post that's there. A few minutes further on. And Bimington's here. <laughs> she suddenly found some energy. Excellent. Come on then. Come on then, let's go get these hairs. You can have a rest. Roman, please don't get wet. Come on <laughs> We're up at the top now, guys. We made it to the top. We now just got to try and find a hair. I have seen one that I flushed earlier on my first exploratory look, but no chance of seeing it and getting a footage because it was just so fast. Running silently across the top. Just a white blur running across it, ran across in that direction from here. So we're now going to have a little wander the three of us, because the kids have recuperated, to see if we can flush a hair by accident, or hopefully see one, and then get a photo. Roman's having great fun, because it's beautiful white-capped snow up here. But it is deep, so Roman, stay to the path, because it gets deep. I don't want to go over the top of your Wellington. Not until we're on the way back, then we play. I'm going to turn the camera off just in case. Uh, but you can see loads of hair footprints if you look here. All this stuff here is hairs going across. Follow the main path, Roman. Well, that's all hair footprints in there. There's loads of activity, but they're just beautifully camouflaged. It's just, I'm just going to find one and be lucky. Mountain hair, dead ahead, he's not the whitest, but we've got him in the snow, he's brilliant. Oh, just going to get the kids over now and then get close to the door. Keep our eye on him to the top. There he is. Beautiful, beautiful in the snow. Got a little bit closer, the kids are coming. The kids are coming. So you can get him. Look at his little white ears at the back. Beautiful. Survived? Yes, there's one. Come on, let's go. So we beat this snow. Hey guys, this here is Hurst Free by Two here. As you can see, it's really snowy. So just a quick tip: if you are going to come out. Do check the weather forecast and try and find the best time for you guys to come out and make sure there is some light for you to see because there is no light anywhere and you can't see anything. So it's, yeah, very poor visibility. So check the time of the sunset, check the weather conditions, make sure you're properly prepared. The first thing you want to do is come out here today ill-prepared because when we came up we had bright sunshine and now we're in a snow blizzard. But we're nearly back at the cars.